Hey miners, Mining King here. Today we're going to check out the Cryo Knight GPU algorithm. So let's get right into it. All right, guys, if you guys didn't check out my last video on Equilibria, I'll leave a link in the card up here, and that way you guys can check out that video. So I recently did a video on Equilibria and how to mine it. And if you come over here to the uh, what to mine, it is on the Cryo Knight uh, algorithm. So as you can see down here for this RTX A2000, they're actually not even listed right now, right? Look, it says zero, zero, Ryo, zero, conceal, zero. They have not tested these, ex you know, extensively yet. Or, you know, maybe they didn't test them at all. I have no idea, right? But there is a lot of coins are in the A2000s that are zeroed. All these coins on the bottom here, all zeros. Not tested. I figured I'd do a video today and show you guys some of my results. Let's go over to my Hive OS. We are over at my overview of my test bench. And I have my AMD cards mining uh, Ravencoin, and then I have my A2000 doing um, Crypto Knight GPU, and these are my overclocks, which are really simple. It's just uh, 350 on the core. So I have found out that, in my experience, at least with this card, the A2000, that the Crypto Knight GPU algorithm is a core-dependent algorithm. I tried all different types of memory overclocks with um no core lock and i put no overclocks on it whatsoever and i ran a bare uh you know stock out of the box i tested core locks um the core locks actually gave you worse than what you did with no overclocks at all so this was the best yield that i could get with the a2000 i tried lots and lots of overclocks so this is the best i could get it's just adding 350 uh, to the core lock. So it is a offset. It is not a core locks because it's under 500. So it is just adding that to the core. So let's go into our miner here. And as you can see, it fluctuates. I got it. I got it up to 17, uh, 1,753 hashes. And it's going around right now, 1719, 1730, 1720. It's been going all, all over the place. So it goes up and down a little bit. There's some variations here. Let's go over to back to our what to mine here, right? Because look, this is, it's not up here on the list, right? It's, it's, it's zero, right? So let's go over here to where I already added it in. So I added 1,730 hashes at 69 watts because that is what we're getting essentially, right? Let's come back over to our what to mine and let's see where it places now. Now, Crypto Knight GPU isn't just Equilibria, it's also uh, Ryo and Conceal. So there's three other coins you can mine. If you guys want videos on that, let me know down in the link below and I'll do how-to videos on how to mine Ryo and Conceal as well. So let's see what we can get here. Oh, well look at that. One of the Crypto Knight GPU algorithms is actually what? Fourth place, it's just three down below Ethereum. Right here, you're gonna be on Ethereum, you're making 81 cents, and then you're gonna profit 61 cents per A2000, right? Give or take, depending on Silicon Lottery and overclocks and all that stuff. This is just like, I use what to mine as a good starting point, right? So it looks like our Ryo though, we will yield 22 Ryo, right? So that's gonna make us 62 cents a day and 45 cents profit. So it's like a 16 cent difference, but I mean, it's still another coin that, hey, maybe you want, you might want to bag this coin, maybe, right? You can get like 20 Ryo off of every A2000 you have. If you have a rig of eight, that's about 160 of these. So just kind of, you know, put that in perspective a little bit. So let's go a little further down the list. And here we go. We actually have Equilibria and Conceal above Flux. So Flux would make you 44 cents a day and you would profit 21 while the while equilibria and conceal will both yield you more than flux right so you will yield 48 cents you will you know that's revenue and then your profit would be 32 
48 cents again on conceal and then profit would be 31 so only a penny difference i guess it would depend on which project you support the most maybe or which coin you think's going to be better in the future so you get about two of these each per day off of each you know a2000 so that's roughly about 16 coins a day if you had a rig of eight of these I just wanted to do this video to give you guys like, you know, some hash rates and some overclocks because as I said before in the beginning of this video, look, this is the basic A2000. When you, when you click A2000, this is what you're going to get, right? They're not listed. They're not tested. They're, they're zeroed. All these coins that are zeroed means that they haven't tested them and they don't have the profitability numbers. So in that regards... I hope this video was informative. It was kind of a quick and easy to the point video. And as I said before, if you guys want me to do videos for Ryo and Conceal, I will do videos on how to mine that and how to make a wallet for those coins as well. Just leave a comment down, down below. If I get enough comments, I will make videos for these. All right, guys, this is the Mining King giving you the most hashes, and I'll see you next time. If you guys like this kind of content, please check out this video or this video. And remember, this is the Monikin giving you the most hashes, and I'll see you next time.